Well, despite warmer weather, tow companies are still plenty busy helping drivers out on the roads. But instead of paying costs upwards of $100 just to get out of a ditch, many are calling a man by the name of Kelly Rust. Mel Meyer has more. I had two jump starts this morning. Kelly Rust says he's answered nearly 100 calls for help this winter. I just pulled a um, gal out of her driveway this morning and I was up on 89. But Kelly isn't with a towing service. It's just him and his 1990 Suzuki sidekick. It uh, might look real tiny or whatever, but it, uh, it does the job. People message him on Facebook, letting him know that they could use a jump start or help getting out of the snow. One woman had her car jumped four times so far. Wouldn't be surprised if I hear from her today. <laughs> sure enough, he did. Later on, Kelly got his second call of the day. After passing by a car stuck in the snow, one driver knew just who to call. Just see him on Facebook and whatnot. And I'm friends with some of his friends, so we've called him before. And while some had doubts that it could be done. The Jeep's too late. Sure enough, Kelly was able to get the truck out. While the driver seemed a little embarrassed by it all, Mosteller says he's glad Kelly was around to help. Kelly does great service, I like it. But someone's doing something for everybody else. When Kelly isn't responding to messages, he says he'll just go drive around, finding those who are stuck and needing his services. He says while he enjoys helping others, it's also helped him get out of the house after suffering a work injury. I'm really tired of staring at my walls, so when people ask for help, it's a way for me to get out of my house. <laughs> From time to time, he'll accept small donations, but usually he'll refuse. About the only time I really do accept is if I need gas or I'm really hungry. <laughs> One woman who didn't want to be interviewed on camera says giving a few dollars for his work is a far cry from the money you'd be paying otherwise. As Kelly says, not everyone can afford such a steep bill. So then they sit there with their car in the ditch or whatever, you know, I'd rather just help them out. Kelly says that he will continue to drive around looking to help others out. In Bemidji, I'm Al Meyer, Lakeland News. The Minnesota State Patrol suggests packing an emergency kit for your vehicle should you be involved in a crash or get stuck out during the winter. Some items you should have on hand include a shovel, jumper cables, a basic tool kit, and extra warm clothes. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.